Did Melvin ever tell you guys my nickname I gave him? No. Mit Mit. I hate you, Ian. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to CZ's channel. It's your girl, Jessie, and it is finally here. We have some of your most requested dancers that you wanted to see in this series. Today's episode of Three Choreographers, One Song will feature dancers Brian Puspos, Melvin Tim Tim, and Ian Eastwood. These three are gonna be performing their pieces to Lemon Pepper Freestyle by Drake featuring Rick Ross. And if you wanna dance like these guys someday, then you need to get training. Luckily for you, there is steezy.co, the best place to learn dance online. If you're a beginner, you can start with the basics and foundations, and when you're ready to, start learning beginner pieces of choreography. There are also intermediate and advanced classes taught by some of the world's best instructors, some of whom are in this video. Okay, we've waited long enough for this one, so let's get into it. Choreographer number one, Brian Puspos. What's up everyone? I'm Brian Puspos. I've danced for Cub Scouts, Most Wanted Crew, and I am a steezy instructor. Yeah. Kind of like a, a reaction. So my general thought process, how much wordplay I could fit within, you know, this time frame, just kind of like this wordplay connoisseur or this wordplay king. My mind kind of forms this like word graph. And so I have the word desert. And then I have all these little branches of like all these possibilities of like sand. I had hot, I had cactus. So I picked sand. How can I bring sand to life? Well, you know, having sand in your shoe. It's almost very pedestrian, but kind of just like bringing that that word to life with desert. I wanted every single word to, to mean something, every move. Full circle, man, I did a circle and I do a full circle with using a circle. Urkel, freaking, I literally turn into Steve Urkel. Patty Mahomes, money, um, what else? <laughs> oh, this guy with the slides. <laughs> Sandal man. <laughs> yeah. Heart just turned purple. 360 Whoa. up front, it all comes full circle. Class wow, photograph, Sandy had me on my Urkel. Urkel, crazy. Patty wow. Mahomes about to fall Sandy short a couple hundred. Sign seal delivered. I the notary republic. She witnessed me sign off on some undeniable numbers. Whoa! Yeah. Whoa! Make a set sell in Croatia to get the leverage. Whoa! Groundskeepers cutting the grass and clipping the hedges. I took two mil out the cage down in the desert. Matthew Maddox calling the pit boss, double checking. Wow. The numbers all good, just pay me, I'm at the Rhino. Real life, the whole it. fam goons it like Rhino. Worth it. One truck in front of me, one behind me to follow. Let me get a lemon pepper on Follow please. under the legs. You gotta head a link before you order these. Docking Ooh. jet skis in the Florida Keys. We all grateful for Wheezy, but no one more than me. Whoa. You just found a bottle with the messages. Concepts for days, bro. Brian is concepts for days. Concept one, concept two, concept three, everywhere. When it comes to concepts, this is what people look up to. <laughs> wow, I didn't even get the asthma pump. He shakes it because it's an asthma pump. The part where the Steve Urkel comes out and he was actually doing musicality. And at the same time, he literally did every single part of what Steve Urkel was. Brian's personality is very goofy. Cause he was like, fixing his pains and he was like, acting like this and then classes on and kind of fixing classes on When you have wordplay within the choreography, you have to almost overcommit to the character that you're trying to portray. If Brian wasn't so committed to the shape of the asthma pump and he just was like, bleh, 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 and he just threw away that detail, I wouldn't have caught his concept. Meanwhile. <laughs> what the freak? Choreographer number two, Melvin Tim Tim. What up guys, this is Melvin Tim Tim. I'm a director of S Rank and I'm also a steezy instructor. Your arms can like, dance around with it. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ian was saying, I can't wait to see you guys' wordplay. And I automatically like freaked out about it. That's not my thing. My inspiration came from them because they're the masters of that stuff. Uh, there's a part where he says, class photograph, Sandy had me on my Urkel. Like Sandy Steve Urkel heart. from Family Matters. Guy with the, the glasses. So I did like, you know, taking a picture, class photograph. It's like Urkel and like a class photo. Let's go. I know 
is about to be some crazy intricate. Oh, don't turn away. Yeah. Heart just turned purple. 360 wow. up front, it all comes full circle. Oh! Last photograph, Sandy had me on my Urkel. Patty Mahomes about to fall Ooh. short a couple hundred. Oh. Sign still delivered. I the know the Republic. She witnessed me sign off on some undeniable numbers. Yeah. Whoa. Make a set sell in Croatia to get the leverage. Groundskeepers cutting the grass. Yeah, it feels the hedges. good. I took two mil out the cage down in the desert. Matthew <laughs> Maddox calling the pit boss double checking. Pathways are crazy. Are me. I'm at the Rhino. It's super Real grounded. Like fam goons like Rallo. Oh. One truck in front of me, one behind me to follow. Oh. Let me get a lemon pepper order, please. You got to head a lake wow. before you order these. Docking jet skis in the Florida Keys. We all grateful for Weezy, but no one more than me. You just found a bottle with the messages. Of course, These days, fast, fame is disconnected from excellence. Half the time, I gotta ask what their profession is. I should a generation, and these are where my <laughs> professions live. Wow, Melvin came super high level, man. Melvin did some ground thing with the knee push, and that was bananas. I feel like that probably takes top floor move of all three. He could turn any concept or anything intricate into a groove. So he's driving a jet ski, but also turned that into a groove. Everything feels super weighted, so you just feel all the kicks and the 808s because he just feels like anchored to the ground. So everything feels really confident and strong. A dancer or non-dancer non watching this should take away from this piece is understanding of flow. So there's no stops, really, in anything that Melvin's doing. It creates a constant, just like, overall connection to the music and feeling. So what I think people should take away from this performance is uh god i was going into something really great it just punches you right in the face um is that too aggressive uh you know although dance could could basically you know god damn it dude suck it so something that people can take away from melvin's performance is his confidence and completely believing in your dance yeah if you don't believe it how are other people supposed to believe it yeah, so yeah. <laughs> but then I come out with that <laughs> Come on, man. Choreographer number three, Ian Eastwood. What's up, you guys? My name's Ian Eastwood, and I've danced for Most Wanted Crew and The Young Lions. I actually had a really hard time deciding on like what direction to go for this piece. I just hadn't spent that much focus on wordplay in like years, probably. Um, so it was a bit of a challenge for me. I actually had to start over three times. I was really happy with where I ended up for Lemon Pepper because I end up on the floor and I'm basically like, I flip the page of a menu. When you order something, you already have planned what you're gonna order, but you like panic when the waiter or waitress comes and then you feel like you need to look at the menu again. And you already know, but you feel like you need to physically touch the menu. Maybe be, maybe I just have a lot of anxiety. <laughs> I thought that was funny because I was like, I really go through this moment in real life and then I, then I order. Uh, Dude, let's go, Ian. Oh my God. Oh. The vibes. No! No! He only did one dance move and I got too excited. Damn. This guy. Here it comes. Yeah. Whoa. Heart just turned purple, 360 up front, it all comes full circle. Class photograph, Sandy had me on my Urkel. Wow. Patty Mahomes <laughs> about to fall short a couple hundred. Sign seal delivered, I f the notary public. Whoa. She witnessed me sign off on some undeniable numbers. Mm. Yeah. Make a set sell in Croatia to get the leverage. Oh. Groundskeepers cutting the grass and clipping the hedges. Whoa. I took two mil out the cage down in the desert. Matthew Maddox calling the pit boss, double checking. Oh. The numbers all good, just pay me, I'm at the Rano. Rano. Real life, the whole fam goes like, like Rallo. Rallo. One truck in front of me, one behind me to follow. Whoa. Let me get a lemon pepper order, please. Oh. You gotta head a link before you order these. Docking jet skis in the Florida Keys. We oh, that's wheezy, but no one oh. me. <laughs> you just found a bottle with the messages. These days, fame is disconnected. Damn, you're so hot. Oh my god. Ian is. I don't know what to 
say about that, man. I gotta watch it again, to be honest, because that was a lot. I gotta watch it. Can I watch it again? Yeah. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah. I just don't know. Yeah. There's a lot. I like, really like a lot of it. A lot of it was so good. Like, I don't know. I don't know, dude. That was like a lot. That was a lot. It was a lot. It was a lot. This boy's in the ocean, freaking doing the backstroke and freaking the ocean. He was like cutting grass, he was like doing the moonwalk at the same time. I was like, damn, bro. Dancing to Drake songs were, was a thing that Ian and I religiously did. He's evolved as a dancer and a person. So to see that incorporated inside this piece, I don't think I was ready for it. One thing that people could take away from this is obviously his storytelling ability and the way that he performs. The commitment of storytelling is very important, when we, especially to that song. So you really have to kind of tap in into the bars. Oh man, this is such a full moment, like full circle moment for me, man. Um, obviously, Ian and I, were, we were best friends, still really good friends today. Um, and yeah, and so just to do something with him again, uh, thank you guys so much, for sure. <laughs> Damn, you're so hot. Oh my God. Thank you so much for watching and thank you to our amazing dancers. This video is proof. When you tell us what you want, we listen. We literally have lists and tallies of requests because we want to give you what you want. So leave a comment below and tell us who you want to see in future episodes. We're invited to the barbecue if you do this. Groove, right? I thought you told us yesterday. I better be going to that damn barbecue, Dom. Yeah, so don't keep it too like this. Um, should be loose, yeah.